Okay. Hi everybody, uh, I'm Margarita, a second year grad student in the Ginger Lab and so today uh, I'm gonna show you our lab. So now I'm gonna show you the uh, research training testbed facility um, that is shared between the uh, Clean Energy Institute and the University of Washington and here uh, is the glove box where we actually uh, create the uh, perovskite phase, the solar cell, and we use this uh, evaporator to uh, evaporate metal contacts, uh, a spin coater to deposit our perovskite active layer, and here is a solar simulator where we take the uh, uh, current and voltage uh, measurement in the dark and in the light. Hey, this is Shudong, Ginger Lab. I'm postdoc right now, and this is our inverted microscope. Normally, we use it for microscopy and spectroscopy. You can use CCD to collect the image, and you can also use the ultra optics to collect spectrum. And uh, with the TCSPC module, you can collect a lot of time resolved data, like the photon massive lifetime and the photon function and antifunction. Uh, so. Uh, now I'm going to show you uh, this uh, um, atomic force microscope which is coupled uh, with uh, an optical microscope and thanks to this setup we are able to um, look at the topography in the nanoscale of uh, our materials but also look at the uh, electronic properties by measuring the surface potential and uh, also conductance which are very useful uh, for photovoltaic uh, materials because we can measure them in the dark and under illumination and this uh, AFM setup uh, it's very um, I mean important because we can see uh, properties in the nanoscale that may be lost when we do normal characterization using uh, spectroscopy methods and here uh, it's where we mostly work on the synthesis of perovskite nanocrystal using the uh, Schlenklein, uh, Schlenklein uh, and auto injection synthesis. Here, people uh, mostly work on organic uh, electrochemical uh, transistor, while in this part of the lab uh, we have a general instrument and our glove box where we store um, air sensitive materials and then uh, we work on uh, gold nanoparticles and uh, we use the uh, UVVIS uh, spectrometer to uh, characterize their absorption.